been, I feel like we, uh, we had pretty realistic expectations of like how much work was going to be required of us um, and of what it would take to get through this and have it feel sustainable. I think having that flexibility between the two people as far as, as tasks, having some overlap and skills and willingness to, um, I don't know what I'm trying to say, I guess, you know, trying to push the roles a little bit more. Not so much That's... my job, your job, but, you know, our job that we do together and here's the things that you normally do but I can cover for you. We were not expecting to be quite so invested. Um, We've definitely, uh, definitely expanded our knowledge and skill base. Uh, having some experience with old, old engines is definitely a, a plus. Um, and I, I did happen to have experience working with uh, vintage diesel engines on some of the other boats that I've, I've worked on. It's called a diaphone horn, um, which is what you're going to hear. Um, well, you wear about as many different hats as you possibly can. Um, so I think, I can't remember exactly what was on the press release that went out when they announced this job, but they were saying, you know, from captain to housekeeper to cook, and it's all of that, and then of course, handyman, concierge, um, you know, just kind of this enormous list of even just like cashier, ringing people up in the gift shop. That's another, you know, important thing, um, another important quality for applicants to have would be an, a passion and fascination with the island, the lighthouse, the history of this place. Um, you have to be so invested out here, not just in time, but in energy and awareness. Um, and having that, um, that pride in what you're doing and, and the, taking joy in sharing that with the guests is a very important quality. Mm -hmm. This is your entire life out here and it's, uh, it's a wonderful life to have. <laughs> <laughs>